from Power BI desktop report page, click on file. On the bottom left, you have options and settings. You can click on options and settings and click on the gear icon options. You can make changes to the settings from here. There is another method on the report page. If you go to the bottom right, click on gear icon. And once you click on the gear icon, a new window will open up and uh, you can make changes here. First, we'll look at the global um, options. So for example, data load, you can make the changes based on your requirement. You can toggle and untoggle the checkbox for time intelligence, etc. So you can make changes um, on a need basis. And if you look at the Power Query, for example, let us try to go to Power Query Editor Options. You can make changes there as well. By default, um, some of the settings are enabled and based on your requirement, you can make changes. For example, R scripting, you can make sure that uh, you're pointing the directory of R installation there. And similarly for Python, you can uh, make sure that the directory is there for the Python as well. And you can make changes for the security. And also if you scroll down, you can make all the changes. You can enable the custom visuals arc g is uh, for power bi map and film map visuals etc right and um, once we are happy here we can go to privacy and you can use any of those radio buttons and regional settings based on your um, settings of your computer it by default it will pick up that uh, display language or you can make changes based on your need and you can make sure that uh, that is checked for updates and in case if you want, you can send the usage data. And similarly for diagnostic options, you can make all the changes. And uh, preview features is uh, pretty important. Every month Power BI will update and add certain features. So make sure that you keep track of them and check those things and select OK. Then only those features will work. And similarly, save and re recover. You can add um, the recovery file locations, etc and report settings you can make the changes there based on your requirement and uh, similarly for copilot if you are signed in and if you have the ability you can use copilot all as well and next is uh, you can make changes uh, based on the file as well so for example for a current file you can make changes for regional privacy data load auto recovery and publish semantic model settings uh, query reduction and report settings. So this is a cool way of uh, making sure that your uh, settings reflect your needs. So to wrap up, this is how you can make changes, uh, global changes. You can make your options for globally and also for um, every file you can make changes. So this is a cool uh, feature and make sure that your settings reflect your needs. Thanks for watching. See you in the next video.